Today is an exciting day in Argentina, around the world, and here in the United States as we celebrate the electoral victory of libertarian president-elect Javier Millet. As a fellow Austrian economist and a fellow presidential candidate with freedom-seeking friends and family in Argentina and around the world, let me assure you, today marks an inflection point in the timeline of the battle for freedom. To those of you in Argentina, I say, today we have hope. Hope that we have not had for Argentina for generations. Hope for a new political relationship to government, certainly. Hope for a new economy, absolutely. And more. We are recapturing the hope to chart our own future. The hope of being treated as more than mere subjects to an imperial and corrupt state. The dignity of living our lives by our own standards. Sixty years ago, the proudest boast was Ich bin ein Berliner. Today, in the world of freedom, the proudest boast is Soy Argentino. To my freedom-seeking friends around the world, I say, this is our call to duty. Because those who wait for a traditional politician to decentralize power, to lead the charge toward a government of delimited power, to hold power to account with a singular focus on protecting our civil liberties, you're waiting for something that's not going to happen. To my friends inside the Libertarian Party, I say this will be up to us. As the philosophical descendants of those who wrote the Declaration of Independence, who wrote the Constitution, who bequeathed to us an opportunity for a very different relationship to government than what we have today. And a bit of advice, you might want to put on your seatbelts because this is going to be a wild ride.